Great to have you with us. I'm Joe Donlin. And I'm Erica Sargent. Tonight, a West Englewood family is grieving and searching for justice for Frederica Coleman. The single mother of eight was gunned down on Father's Day in front of her home, and her killer has not yet been caught. CBS 2's Suzanne Lemigno joins us now live from Chicago Police Headquarters with this family's story. Suzanne? Joe, Erica, police here are telling us that detectives are still investigating and there's no one in custody. It's not clear why this young mother was shot, but one thing is very clear. Her family wants justice. She was somebody and we loved her. Frederica Coleman was the single mother of eight children. My mom, she made everything to me. Coleman was known in her West Englewood neighborhood as a person who sold home cooked meals and candy. The 36 year old did those jobs to set her own schedule to care for her children. She loved her family. Coleman, who had the words family first tattooed around her neck, was gunned down in front of her home near 64th and Marshfield on Father's Day. They really took our mom away from us. Coleman had gone to the store to buy groceries and was getting ready to walk into her apartment around 8.30 at night. Just coming home to her kids, all eight of us coming home to us, and now she's not going to be with her kids for something that had nothing to do with her. Witnesses saw two different cars going down the street with people waving guns out the windows, but didn't see them shooting. They later heard 11 to 16 gunshots. Coleman was shot in the head while her children were waiting for her inside their apartment. They looking out the window, all they see is their mom being rolled away on a gurney. They traumatized. Her son called me and was like, Auntie, my mom is dead. He was right there holding his mom. Coleman's sister set up this GoFundMe page to raise money to care for all eight children. The youngest is four, the oldest, 19. They still cry. They miss their mom. Coleman's sister is now caring for her six nieces and two nephews. They need counseling. We, they need it together. And I also needed counseling too to be able to provide for them. That GoFundMe page set up about six days ago has raised about $4,200. We have a link to it on our website for you at cbschicago.com. At Chicago Police Headquarters, Suzanne Lemigno, CBS2 News. Suzanne, thank you.